really the interesting race Maddie because Stevens. everybody got out a little faster than I Two usually like to, but Romero. I knew that that was how it was going to be just because it's state and everybody goes Marie to all Daniel. the fast teams. And so I knew that I needed to make sure I got out so I didn't get boxed in too bad. And I really just wanted to get the rest of my team in a good spot so that they could compete as well. Seemed like you had a really good leg there. Are you feeling pretty good when it off? I am. That was, it was a lot of fun because I did feel really nervous before and I was really kind of tired, but I just I got out there and I ran and it, I just went with the pack and it was a lot of fun. Aubrey, tell us about your leg of the race. How'd you um, get so when Claire turned the corner, I wasn't exactly like, I didn't know where she was. I was like, oh gosh, Claire. But you know, I came out and Matt's just been telling that, you know, me and Mariah, we just got to keep the spot. We got to maintain and get our anchors in a good spot. So, you know, I kind of came out and I was getting some good practices in this week. So I felt a lot better than I did at districts because I haven't really been training for the 800 for very long. But I'm glad that this is my first time here and I can't wait to, you know, come back. She was on that winning quartet last year. Um, you know, it's hard, you know, we have first ADM. round tomorrow, and so, you know, soccer is always in the back of my mind along with track, and so, you know, I got to come here and I focus on track, and I don't really worry about soccer, and it was hard in the beginning of the season. Easter, run brand on the third my body just didn't really know what I was doing yet, powers. but, you know, I was a sprinter at first, so I did all the sprint workouts, so it wasn't as bad, but, you know, I... I really enjoyed this season, and so I'm probably going to do both next year. When and how did you kind of realize you're a better fit for a well, longer distance? The sprints just were really clicking, I guess. Um, in middle school, I ran 800s and 400s, and I don't know, the sprints just really weren't for me, and I could tell. And I think everybody could tell, and it just wasn't my favorite thing. I didn't really enjoy doing it. Right, what do you think of the experience out there? Uh, I thought it was pretty good because Claire got us in a really good spot and then Aubrey kept us there. And like she said, Matt told us that me and Aubrey had to keep the spot for even And three inches separate one and two, Claire. lead out and push. I just, I felt really good, Solo but I was going to tie it up the beginning. But otherwise, I, I thought it was good. Does this compare to any other one you've run in so far this year? Um, not really. Because I have, I've, this is like my first year, so. What do you think of the atmosphere? Mount Vernon. I, I love it. I love Chad. Dallas Center Drive. Are you going to let's hear about your anchor leg? Um, yeah, um, starting back with my teammates, they did so good and they pushed so well, especially Claire Pellet. She had a great PR and she just really carried us to get a good spot. And the others just carried us to keep us there. And I just felt really good today and it was just so fun to experience everything. And it was good to get our first overlay in. It seems like a group that really supports each other, cheers for each other. What's that dynamic like? Um, it's amazing. It's so nice to have a group of girls that are such good teammates and we're all like a family and we're all super close. So it's so nice to have the teammates lean on when we're struggling.